Hey guys and gals, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, how is it going? How are you doing? Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, and welcome to another tutorial from Hey Marcel. <laughs> now, before I continue, here's what I want you to do. I want you to like, comment, or subscribe so you can stay notified every time we do a video like this or go live yeah baby boy baby girl y'all know what it is you and hey marcel's world now before we get into all of this stuff down here we're gonna go right upstairs now pay attention closely because i'm going to show you some things now right here is we have our enchantment center since we're doing the afk fish farm and you know we get a lot of enchanted books and stuff like that and if we want to re-enchant them i'm going to show you some things that we can do now, right here, we have our enchantment center. Like I said, we got the anvils there. We got the uh, uh, storage chest here. We fill this up with lapis. And you put your armor and weapons and all of that type of stuff that you get. You can put it in there and enchant it. And over here, we got the beds with the storage system. And we got a back patio if you want to just come take a cool breeze and check out the rabbits doing their thing. And also, just let me show you guys the background. The backyard, I mean. Uh, boom, 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 boom. <laughs> yeah, so I just wanted to decorate it, man, make it look nice, you know. I wanted to do like a fully full nice thing, what you can do with these tutorials, man. You see over there, right there, you know, when you build these machines and stuff like that and you come up with some things, you know, it just looks like that. So I wanted it to look really nice, man. So I added a few things in there. So let's get back inside so I can show you what we got going on here. Bought me some Vincent Van Gogh's and Mario's <laughs> to decorate the place. You know what I mean? So, right here, uh, matter of fact, you know what? Let's go over here. Right over here, we have a uh, weapon equipper, uh, armor equipper. And, yeah, this is it. I just did a tutorial on this thing right here. And if you want, you just hit the button. Bingo, bango. <laughs> yeah boy and let me show you something cool right so it gives you the blade and it also gives you the chest plate in your inventory and you know why because if we hit f5 and we'll hit it again you can see that i'm donned in full gear even the elytra so if you wanted to hook that up you can it's just a little added extra bonus thing that we got in um my house here so then on the left and the right, you see here, we have the item sorting system, uh, storage system hooked up. So, and we're doing some grindstones over here. Um, and you just jump up here and you pull out your fishing rod and then you just go for it. You know what I mean? You hit that up right there. This is not my design. I did not build this, um, but you know, I did do everything else and hook it up and added everything together so if you guys wanted to do this thing in your um minecraft survival world you guys can definitely do it so what i have up above the water is a glass block and then a and bingo bango all right we're gonna stop right there and you can see here we have glass blocks so we can keep the uh daylight or the sky access to the fish farm so what happens is anytime you catch an item it'll go into this hopper here that's how that works and it'll go into this large chest but what i did is i added uh the item sorting systems and i also added uh um non-stackable item sorter in here and you know i didn't cover this up because it actually messes with it so you can't really do too much with it so i got it out and open hope you guys don't mind uh we threw some cactuses there but anyway when the item goes in here right and let me say we're gonna throw in this diamond sword bingo bango right so what will happen is it's gonna go through here this is gonna check and see if it's a stackable item or a non-stackable item so that way when it's a non-stackable item it'll actually just come across here and hit this and you can see we got the diamond sword there so i've been doing a little fishing and you can see that we got saddles we got fishing rods we got enchanted books we got bows some of the bows are enchanted and we got saddles and things of that nature so anything that's non-stackable uh, actually just go through the system now what happens is if you get a stackable item so all right so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take all 29 of these right and we're gonna drop these things in there bingo bingo and you can listen for the sound you can see it going off checking and <clears throat> what happens is it you hear it there it goes clicking 
So that means the system is working. What happens is there's another hopper under here and it drops down and then it comes around here and it actually goes straight across there into our dropper system with a uh, block of soul sand on it. Shoots it into the water, the water goes up, goes across the hoppers and it'll go this way and check and see if it's here. And you guys can see items came in and um, then it will actually go over here to the end and doesn't make it you know if it's not on this side it uh drop where are we at okay <laughs> so it'll drop down there and then come across the bottom here we have an ice thing over here let's see if we can check in so you guys can see it you guys can see it right there that's our water system sends it over to the side another dropper vader system comes across and then it puts it in there now if the items do not make it into any one of these because we have this here so this is for tropical fish, puffer fish, rotten flesh, and bowls because we don't have a setup for those. Um, because actually, your boy Hey Marcel was just speeding around. So any of this stuff, when it gets across, it actually land in here. <laughs> so and then I made a nice cool landing right there. We put the lights in here, man. I really hope you guys like this. Now this is just a showcase video, and I know I said tutorial in the beginning, but I am going to do the tutorial now um once this is done i'm working on the tutorial while you guys are watching this so i really hope you like it we're going to do a pan around so you guys can see um did the nice de uh, decorum we got the lead bushes the line it and the uh i like this texture pack because it has like fence you know instead of iron bars which is pretty cool then we put the lamp post for every entrance made the paths which you know i had to put in myself because we don't have grass in this so and you come around the side and you guys check it out and then you know that technically on the other side is the back of the house but this is the front of the house but anyway you know we did a little thing so i just wanted to do some decorum around it so you guys can actually get a feel for what it is that you want to do when you build this um and like i said man if you're new what i want you to do man is make sure you hit the subscribe button man hit that bell so you can stay notified every time we do videos like this or every time I do a video like this or go live man and I really appreciate you guys checking it out man this is hey Marcel and bringing to you another showcase video man that's what I love to do <laughs> So guys, thanks for stopping by, man. I really appreciate all the love and support. I am currently reaching for 300 subscribers. Yay! I am so excited, man, that people are really liking the videos, man, and the content it is pretty. Yes, 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 we do. We do love it. We love it. <laughs> but like I said, I want to thank you guys for stopping by, man. Make sure to check out the tutorial. You guys are greatly appreciated because without you, I would not be here, man. Keep a smile on your face, man, and goodness in your heart, man. And if nobody told you they love you today, just know that, hey, Marcel loves you. Peace!